Is this a normal Wind Down Wednesday? Tequila Tuesday! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Morning, I've just woken up. I had a good night's sleep on that mattress of uh, I got up like just after 10. I've had a good sleep, but my throat is a bit sore, so I hope I'm not coming down with anything or I am screwed. I haven't eaten since on the train yesterday, so I'm really, really hungry. Um, Gabby has said that I can sort of like help myself here, but at the same time, I don't want to take advantage. And there's hotels around the corner, so I'm gonna go and try and sneak in for breakfast. So let me show you. So I am where that dot is and then the Fairfield Inn and Suites by the Marriott is there. So I'm gonna go down there now and check it out and hopefully I can get some breakfast because I am hungry. Right, I'm just getting there now, it is. Right, let's go and check it out. Complimentary breakfast up until 9.30. And the time is 10.49. Absolutely devastated. So I'm just looking at other hotels and there's a Pod DC hotel. I ain't got a clue what a Pod DC hotel is, but I'm gonna go and check out there, see if they're still serving. If not, there is coffee here, so I'll grab some free coffee here if worst case. Just getting to the Pod hotel now, let's check this out. How does breakfast work here, guys? Is it included in the stay or? It's not included. It's no, not. We're a separate entity. Does the hotel have somewhere for breakfast or the hotel Pardon? guests come down here? They come here. They come here, do they? Mm -hmm. Right, it's not happening there either because where the hotel guests have breakfast underneath, it's just totally separate to the hotel, so it's got nothing to do with the hotel. So it is literally like a restaurant. Right, I'm going to fly back to the Marriott and grab a free coffee. That's all I'm getting this morning. You are not going to believe this. So I've just got back to the Marriott and the coffee's gone. So I can't even get a free coffee now either. This day is not starting well, is it? Is there any chance I could grab a quick coffee? Is there any left? Oh, I really appreciate that. Thank you very much for your help. Uh, one cup, yeah. Thank you very much. So it looks like we're getting a coffee after all. Happy days. Ah, that's great. Thank you so much. Yeah, I'll grab some milk. Thank you. Well that was lucky, I got a coffee after all. Right, I'm gonna head back to Gabby's now. I'm gonna figure out what my plans are for today and for tomorrow, because I've got a feeling today's gonna be my last day in DC, even though I've just got here. Right, I'm back at Gabby's, I'm doing some work. I need to sort out where I'm staying tomorrow because it looks like I'm going to stay in Gabby's again tonight. I'm going to go to North Carolina tomorrow, so I need to ring Tom, a guy who messaged me, one of the subscribers from North Carolina, before I'd even set off on this journey, so I need to give him a call. But first, I'm going to jump on an Instagram Live. Hey! hey. How's it going, the trip? Yeah, it's not going bad, mate. A bit of a struggle. How long do you think it's going to last, then? Another week, or...? The way I'm going, mate, it's like 6,000 miles. I've not even dinted it yet. What's up? Hey! Hey Tom, how's it going mate? There it is. Can't wait to meet you and everything. <laughs> mate, I've never been to North Carolina, so I'm really, really looking forward to it. So I got some good places to take you to. We're gonna just kinda chill and hang out on uh, Friday and stuff like that. So. Sweet man, I'm looking forward to it. What's been the hardest thing so far? The hardest thing so far? It's getting somewhere to sleep mate, that's the hardest bit. Yeah. Oh, mate? thank you very much for, for help with the YouTube channel setting it up to start off with. Ah, no worries so. at all mate. I'll always help where I can, mate, so always, like, drop questions and stuff. To be honest, the best way to sort for me to see stuff is if you either comment on the YouTube video or just comment on my Instagram post, and because I, I always look at them, like... Yeah, appreciate it. Sweet. Very much. Have a good one, mate. Nice to meet yeah. you. Well, that was a successful live stream. Obviously, spoke to Tom as well, so let's get that sorted for North Carolina now. Hey, what's up? Hey, how's it going, Tom? You okay, man? <laughs> mate, you're in the vlog. What's going on, guys? How's it going? For tomorrow... It's totally up to you. You let me know, I'll go ahead and book it right now. Awesome, I really appreciate that, man. I just saw the video where you cannot get any help. What is he doing to you? I know, you tell me. I do have a friend that lives there, and I've reached out to her to see if she would be able um, to assist you. Because I'm literally just living, you know, every day as it comes, to be honest, at the minute. Honestly, I appreciate the contact, man. Thank you. I'll just get off work and come pick you up, and then uh, we'll see what kind of trouble we can get into. Sweet. I like it, man. I like it. I can't wait, Simon. It's going to be good. Yeah, it is, man. 
and looking forward to it. Thanks for all your help, Tom. Thank you, mate. Cheers, man. I'll speak to you later. What a cool guy. North Carolina tomorrow. I've never been there before, so I'm looking forward to it. Right, I am absolutely starving. I still haven't eaten anything today. All I've had is that coffee. So, I am going to try the McDonald's trick. For those of you who don't know the McDonald's trick, this is what it looks like. McDonald's is a nine minute walk from where I am, 0.3 miles. So I'm gonna give them a call. Can I help you? Uh, hi, I've just ordered a large Big Mac meal with fries um, and I've got home and it's like cold and it's not even right. Do you wanna come back for a new one? Yeah, is that, is that all right if I can just come back? Okay. Okay, my name's Simon. Who do I ask for when I come back? Ask for Wendy. Okay, cool. So I'll ask for Wendy when I come. Okay, thank you so much. Okay, thank you. Bye. <laughs> this can't work, surely. Right, let's go to Mackey's. To be fair, I have actually never done this McDonald's hack. A few of my friends have done it, I've heard about it, and a couple of people have actually commented on the YouTube videos about it as well. This is actually a first for me. Excuse me, man. I did ring up and spoke to someone called Wendy. Um, I ordered a large Big Mac meal and it was like all cold and stuff. And I rang up and they said just to come back. All good, yeah? Okay, sweet. You want awesome. a ketchup? Uh, yeah, I'll have some ketchup and some sweet and sour. Perfect, thank you very much. That was a lot easier than expected. I've got a feeling we'll be using that hack again before I get to LA. So I've just been reading the comments on today's vlog, yesterday's vlog, and just to clarify, that obviously I can't get subscriber help, but I will be sneaking into places. If he thinks I am not sneaking into places and no subscriber help, he's got another thing coming. Roll on the hotel breakfast next week. Also, on the Instagram Live, a lot of people are asking when I'm gonna do a skin giveaway. So, let's do one. So I'll be giving away one t-shirt and one hoodie. All you've gotta do is share my channel, like this video and comment below, and I'll announce the winners in like one or two days. I'll, I'll let you all watch it first. Now I'm heading to the War Museum. I'm quite looking forward to this, I've always wanted to go. Right, I'm just at the Washington Monument now. This is pretty cool, to be honest. It looks a lot bigger on the telly, though. You know, and the reflecting pool is pretty cool. And the Jefferson Memorial, you can go into, it's open air. So I just met these guys by the Washington, oh, the Washington Monument, the Washington isn't it? Monument, That's yeah. all. We're headed, where are we headed now? We're headed over to the World War II Memorial. Yeah. Ah, okay, cool. Yes. Because obviously I wanted to see the War Memorial, so we're heading over there now. Is it the reflective pool, you said? There's a reflect, so from here you'll hit the, uh, the, the World War II Memorial. Yeah. And then after the, right behind that is the reflective pool and that leads to the Lincoln Memorial. Ah, okay, cool. And what were yeah. the cherry blossoms you were sitting about? Cherry blossoms are on the tidal basin, which is like parallel to where the reflective pool is. Yeah. And it happens uh, once a year. All That's the blossoms crazy. open and up. And it's yeah. just now. And it's happening right now, so you're, you're so here in awesome. town for the right time. Definitely, I can't wait yeah, to check that out. Absolutely, huh? brother. So you see, that's Memorial. the World yep. War II right here in the middle. Yep. Ah, okay, well, that's, that's in the middle there. Then that's the reflective pool. Yep. And then the Lincoln Memorial behind it. So Thanks very yeah, much, man. Appreci safe, safe yeah, 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 appreciate it. Yeah, appreciate that, guys. Yourself. How cool were them guys? Right, now I've been to the Memorial. I am going to the Title Basin, I think he said. I haven't got a clue what the Title Basin is, but we said it was pretty cool, so let's go and check it out. Ah, this is where he meant the cherry blossoms of bloom. They are pretty cool. I don't know how well they're coming across on the camera. Yeah, I'm just having a proper tourist day today. Obviously, North Carolina tomorrow, so just want to get in as much as DC as I possibly can while I'm here. I'm going to head towards Congress or the Senate or whatever it's called and then probably go back to Gabby's from there but we'll see how we get on. I'm just walking down the path now where like the presidential inaugurations are so you've got the monument there and then you've got the Senate thing behind me. Some walk this though, Jesus. Especially when your feet are absolutely killing you. I don't know how my feet are gonna last me till LA. Oh my God.
Right, I finally made it to the end. The Senate building is there. You've got the Washington Monument, which is right in the back there. That's how far I've walked. So this is where the presidential inauguration is. I think I'm saying that right. Literally, like, there are all the fields that all the people would stand. And obviously the president would be up there. So I think that's enough for today's history lesson. I'm going to head back to Gabby's now, who's just dropped me a text saying that she's just finished her workout. She's having some friends over for wine or something tonight. So let's see. I'm going to head back there now. Right, I've just got back to Gabby's now. Um, I've got her keys, and obviously she's got roommates, so I don't just want to like let myself in without her. So she's heading back from the gym. So I'm just waiting for her to get here so I can give her the keys. Hey, hey how are you? Good, how's just your letting day? you into your own apartment. Appreciate it. Uh, is this like midweek party? Yeah. Mid Wind down Wednesday. Wind down Wednesday. <laughs> Wind down. Is this like a every week sort of thing? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers, congratulations. Cheers, thank Yay. you. You're not Cheers. Is that like a thing in America? It's like a thing for ladies every Wednesday. White girls, well, no, White girls in America, really. Wine Down Wednesday. Yeah. Right, we're introducing Wine Down Wednesday to the UK. Yes. Can yeah. you um tell them that CJ and Gabby coined that term? Is it, what, are you like patenting that, yeah? No, I wish. Wine Wednesday. Is this a normal Wine Down Wednesday? Tequila Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I'm gonna end the vlog there. North Carolina tomorrow. Throw your hands up, take your shirt off, push it on your face. <laughs> <laughs> North Carolina for razor.